What's up you guys? Today I'm here to bring you another Anabolic Superset Finisher video. But before we get into the video, a lot of you guys are watching our videos and you aren't even subscribed to the channel. So while you're here, why don't you go down just below the video, find that subscribe button, click that thing. So now that we're back to the video and now you're subscribed, we're going to talk about what we're doing today and that is we're going to crush the forearms and you're probably wondering why I'm holding like a lat pull down bar and this is all you need for this workout. So basically any sort of weighted pull shape thing is going to work for this exercise and this one's actually pretty heavy. So we're going to be doing three exercises and we're going to train each arm independently for this finisher. So I'm going to put the workout up on screen for you guys so you can check that out and then we're going to get right into the video and the first thing we're going to do is start with a forward rotation. So I'm going to use my offhand arm to prop up this arm. We're going to keep it up right about parallel with the floor. We're going to have the bar go straight forward and then we're going to start. We're going to do 15 reps for each exercise. So ready, set, go. Whew. So all the way down the parallel and all the way up the other way. Good. Ooh, there's three, oh, four, and five. So guys, if you want to increase the difficulty, all you have to do is slide your hand down. And I guarantee you, I can't even get one. Maybe I can't even do that hard enough. One rep. We're going right back down because there's no way I'm getting 15 if I do it that way. So here we go. Hands back to normal. Back and forward. God. Eight. Nine. So same thing guys, if you want to make it easier, slide your hand up even higher. Here we go. Ten. Woo! Shake it out. Already shaking. Now we're on the first one. Here we go. Eleven. I just spit everywhere. I hope everyone saw that. That's how you get more views when you spit all over the camera. Thirteen. Woo Fourteen. Oh. God. One more. Come on. Get up there. Come on. Let's go. Perfect form in this one. Straight up, forward, go, 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 go. Woo! There's one. That's already enough of a burnout, but that's not enough for it, guys. So now we're gonna start with rotations, and you're gonna start in the middle. So hold this like a freaking crossbow. Here we go. We're gonna rotate basically 180 degrees side by side. This time straight up. Here we go. 15 reps. Oh. Guys, and if this isn't hard enough for you, you can slide down to either direction. So, you can slide this way, for example. Here we go. And back the other way. Yeah, but we're not going to do that because it's really freaking hard. And if yours weighs this much, you're not going to be able to do it either. So, here we go. Starting off at six, now we got seven. Nice and controlled. go. Forearms already blocking up. Feels great though. Guys, get a nice forearm punt. Really build those forearms. Here we go. Uh, 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 uh. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Uh, let's go, let's go. Good. Woo. All right, guys, so the last one in this set, we're going to do rear rotation. So now we're gonna grab the lower part of the bar, so the more forward part. We're gonna kick this bar back up behind us so our arms are gonna be straight down. And basically this bar is gonna to touch the back of my arm, so we're squeezing back and up. So basically it's gonna start parallel with the floor. We're gonna kick it all the way up to the back of the arm. Ah. Try to freeze it at 90 right here instead of letting it come all the way down. So here, and up. Freeze it, ah. freeze it. And up, oh guys, come on, that's it, seven, come on, eight, Woo. hands slipping down, it's getting a little sweaty, a little hard to hold on to, wipe off that hand, get right back into it, here we go, eight, nine, nine, nine. Oh. Woo. three more reps to go guys, here we go, shake it out, get right back at it, here we go. Parallel. Up. And up. And up. Woo. All right, guys. That bruise was 
That was actually my strong arm. I probably should have started with the other side. But, you know, we all make mistakes, and now it's time to just absolutely roast this next one. So, here we go. Again, guys, holding that arm up. Prop it, forward, down, and we go. Hands already start to slip. And slipping again, guys. You're gonna get sweaty during this. You need to make sure you keep your hands dry. If you have some chalk or you have some dirt or whatever, guys, do whatever you need to do to hold on to this bar, because it's gonna get hard to hold. And it's gonna be really, really slippery. God, come on. Go! All right, guys, got three more reps. Drying off that hand again, you know. Probably shouldn't have done up my hair for this video because I got gel all over it, making it a little more complicated, too. Here we go. Get it up. Two more. One more. This one's gonna be rough. There we go. Please, please, go. Oh, guys, that's tough. Here we go. Right back into these little crossbow rotational things. Here we go. Split the hand in half, arms straight out, we're rotating. Here we go. Nice and controlled. Come on, keep pushing. the halfway point well, was as close as you can when you have an odd number at the end but hey seven is about halfway here we go let's finish the rest prop that arm up if you need it here we go guys got four more reps wipe off that sweat grab the bar get right back get it forward to go this up here we go last one you already know how to do it same thing this side keep it at parallel with the floor kick that right back up to the back of your arm here we go ready uh, starting to dip gonna hold on tight keep push it and start to slip we're gonna reposition here we go Whoa. Nine. Come on, keep it up. Come on. Yeah, keep the tension on. Come on, come on. Oh. Every time the hand slips, guys, I want to make sure I reposition to keep the strain on it. Here we go. Come on, come on. Let's do one more, one more, one more, one more. No. Get that thing down, guys. I mean, this arm's starting to recover just a little bit, but this arm is absolutely fried. You know, if I wasn't so, you know, Elmer's glue white, I'm sure you could see a little bit of vascularity, but the camera just doesn't want to really pick up on it too much. But guys, forms are full of blood. This is a great routine to add into the, any of your pull days, your arm day. Basically, you can fit it in anywhere because grip is so applicable to so many different types of routines. So make sure you give this video a thumbs up. Leave a comment down below, and you better be following us on Instagram, at Anabolic Aliens, and I'm gonna put a picture up on it, and you better go to the link that I post in the pinned comment down below and go follow us right now, and I'll see you in the next video. Peace. Together, we got power. That's just rapping.